present times in which catastrophe and disaster seem to be the only possible scenarios in near futures? These times in which the visible ecosocial alternatives seem to have come to an end, we find it crucial to generate new narratives, new stories about possible livable futures able to challenge our present ways of living and how we relate to each other and the other living beings that inhabit planet Earth. Why do humans pretend to be healing a damaged planet and don't realize that it is the planet the one who is taking care of ourselves? human survival possible is the balance of the ecosystems. It is not that humans are destroying the planet, but rather it's that our waste of life are generating waste that the planet needs to rebalance in its cycles of matter and energy. Preservation that could lead to the suppression of mammals from the environment. The planet mutates. It adapts itself with all of its cycles. From our cyanobacterial ancestors that produced an atmosphere with oxygen to a possible future in which nitrogen would cause humans pulmonary asphyxia. existed prior to us and would continue to exist without human beings. The planet works fine. The interest in saving the human species is nothing but the desire of keeping a lifestyle based on the flow of money, consumerism and the wealth of the rich. of this 
artificial idea we have of wildlife enclosed in nature reserves? How can we abandon the illusion of a convenient nature in which mosquitoes don't bite and viruses never kill? dualisms or binarisms, genetic necrophiles, terrestrial aliens, errant communities, beings that have always been there in the shadows of humans, which will turn out to be the protagonist of the microbiotic history. Earth will not die because it is a mutant being. 